I think the event is a great opportunity to bring together some of the brightest minds in the city and beyond to solve some of the challenges that the city faces as one of the world's most popular tourist attractions. We're a very well-known city already, but there are lots of new opportunities to grow new markets. The big outcome I'm looking for New people thinking in different ways about some of the challenges and opportunities for our sector. Such a varied range of data sets from so many different providers and I think only by bringing those data sets together can you really start to look at avenues and alternative kind of ways of looking at what is living and breathing in the city. Product Forge has a very strong reputation in the industry in delivering this type of thing so it's helped the profile of our event become higher. I also want to see people who could look to take their ideas and transform them into a commercial opportunity. I like the three-day format. The previous hackathons I've been to, it was quite different. Here it's a bit more like planning, you kind of coached along the way, whereas there you kind of expected to like make things up on the fly. Here there's a lot more time to develop the idea. I think this one's probably better because it gives you like more opportunities to further the idea commercially later. I'm one of the members of the winning team at the local transport product board. I was really happy to be invited back to mentor. I'm really impressed by what the tourism hackathon is pulling off so far in terms of what people are doing. I think the, the people that have come are all really up for it and there's real buzz about it. We're at sort of midway through day two. I'm here because I have a travel and tourism business. I was quite nervous at first when I got here. I didn't think I would get a team, but it happened quite organically, and I think our team mesh really well together, and everyone's really supportive. I've never been to a hackathon before. Uh, this is my first time. I'm a newbie, but I'm very much enjoying the experience so far. It's what I was probably most surprised about is the range and spectrum of participants. I thought it would just be a bunch of people sitting at computers just doing code, and it's a lot more free and open and it's just a nice way to put your ideas forward and get feedback on them. I think what's really interesting about the tourism challenge is it's something we've all got a stake in in the city. I would like to see five really innovative ideas being taken forward at the end of this event. The Edinburgh Tourism Innovation Challenge is the first part of a, a longer stream of events. It's about helping the industry change, it's about helping entrepreneurial people that are here today take the next step in their journey in terms of coming up with a commercial idea. And it's also just about the kind of innovation that happens when new people look at challenges with a different set of eyes. I'm having a great time. It was a difficult decision, um, but the judges have decided the winners fully.